Hello everyone, this is Amrita, your ESL teacher. I hope you all are just doing great. Welcome to TESOL 3 Minute English. Do you want to speak English like a native English speaker? If yes, then you will have to start using English that native English speakers use in their daily life conversations. We should stop using the exact expressions that we have been using from our childhood and it's just the textbook expression. No, we'll have to start using expressions like native English speakers and let's learn some expressions that native English speakers use in their daily life conversations. So today we are going to learn different ways to say I'm hungry. We all get hungry at some point during the day. So we should know how to say I'm hungry in different ways like native English speakers. Expression number one, you can say I'm starving. Instead of saying I'm hungry, you can say I'm starving. I'm starving. Remember, you will have to repeat three times after me. I'm starving. I'm starving. I'm starving. Starving means you are too much hungry. You just want to eat something. All right, good. Number two, I'm famished. I'm famished. I'm famished. Say it loud. I think you were repeating after me, right? Okay, so I'm famished. So famished means you are less energetic now and you should eat something and you are just starving, you are too much hungry. So instead of just saying I'm too much hungry or I'm very hungry, you can say I'm starving or you can say I'm famished. Expression number three, I can eat a whole cow. It's not like you are going to eat a whole cow, but it's more like you are too much hungry that you can eat a whole cow. Sounds funny, right? But native English speakers often use this expression when they are really very hungry. Then you can say, I can eat a whole cow. Or you can even say, I can eat a horse. I can eat a horse. Expression number four. My stomach is growling. My stomach is growling. It's, it's kind of growling feeling inside your stomach, right? So you can say when you are too much hungry, your stomach gets growling. So you can say, my stomach is growling. My stomach is growling. Okay? Repeat three times. Expression number five. I can eat like an oaf. I can eat like an oaf need to grab something. I can eat like an oaf. That means you are very hungry. You should eat something right away. And that's why you can say, I can eat like an oaf. And native English speakers often use this. I can eat like an oaf. Expression number six. I've got the munchies. I've got the munchies. That means you want to munch something. You are you are feeling hungry, not too much hungry, but you are hungry. You want to grab something. You need uh, to eat something to get energy back. So you can say, I've got the munchies. I've got the munchies. That means you feel like eating something right now. I've got the munchies, okay? I've got the munchies. Last but not the least, you can say, I have an appetite have an appetite it's um, formal so you can use this in a formal situation like I have got an appetite I have an appetite I have an appetite I hope you have uh, found it quite useful and you are going to use these expressions in order to speak like a native English speakers hope to see you again with some new expressions till then take care Allah Hafiz.